Hello friends, so today I have a bit of a rant for you, and it's going to be another rambly type rant video. I know it's two in a row, but whatever, it doesn't matter. So, I have a Discord server, and I really like it. We uh, It took me a long time to actually, you know, be brave enough to set one up, because we all know Discord communities can be kind of, um, how would you say, filled with negativity, I guess would be the, the, the nice way of saying it, but... For the most part, the Discord server that I've set up has been very, very nice. We have a lot of really good conversations. You should definitely join it. There's a link below. But the point is, it's really nice. However, every once in a while, something something is said that triggers me. The GNOME video that I did last week where I was talking about the pronunciation of GNOME and Mate and all that stuff was triggered by someone on the, the Discord. and uh, Or maybe it was in the YouTube comments. It doesn't really matter. But... The, the point is, every once in a while, someone says something that just causes me to go off and go on a rant. And because it's what I do, I'm making a video about it. So this time, I want to talk about GNU slash Linux versus Linux. Now, if I were a, tr a traditional Linux nerd, I would go off and talk about how we should all be calling it GNU slash Linux. And if you call it just Linux, you're obviously doing it wrong. And you're a dumbass and all this stuff. But that's not my point of view. I don't think that way at all. Instead, I pretty much think that we should just call it Linux. I think if you're calling it GNU slash Linux, you're just confusing people. Yes, that is technically correct. It's absolutely correct. It's literally what we're talking about when we talk about Linux for the most part. Unless you're talking just about the kernel. Because, I mean, for the, I guess, before we get into that, before it... If you don't know, when Linux, if you just talk about Linux, technically what you're talking about is the kernel that the system runs on. Everything else together, when you combine it all together, it's GNU slash Linux. But that's really, you know, beside the point. The point is, is that when we have a, a, we have a vast community of nerds here, and there is a small subsection of that that can't get past this idea that we have to call it GNU slash Linux. So that's my point of contention. Because I think by forcing us to call it GNU slash Linux, we would actually be limiting the number of people who would be interested in using Linux because it's not a good name, right? One of the important things when we're trying to market our operating system to non-users of it is desirability of the name. And while you know, Linux isn't a great name in and of itself, I mean, argue it either way, it becomes way worse when you tack on GNU slash Linux because people just get confused. It makes it more confusing. And no matter how appropriate or how technically true that that name would be, Linux itself is a better brand than GNU slash Linux. It just is. So we're not going to call it GNU slash Linux anymore. We're just going to call it Linux, which is what most people do anyways, but there, to those people who out there who feel the need to constantly correct us when, we, when we're talking about Linux, uh, stop doing that, because I'm not going to stop calling it Linux. I'm just going to call it Linux as much as I want, because that's what it is to me. It's not... I, when I decided to start a podcast back in 2017 with my friend Ricky, and we, when we were looking at names... Never once did we decide we were going to call it the GNU slash Linux cast. We just never did because that was a hor that would be hor that would that'd be a horrible name. I mean, it'd just be a bad name. <laughs> of course, we were going to call it the Linux cast or something with Linux in the name. You know, we, we came up with several different title op you know options. None of them had GNU slash Linux, and it was just Linux. And I think that that for most people. That makes sense. It makes it simpler. It makes it you know easier to remember. It doesn't involve us devolving into a, a a nerd fight over what things technically should be called, you know. So GNU slash Linux technically true. We're just gonna call it Linux. I think we should start a movement. It should be rebranded as just Linux. Now, at the end of the day, it obviously doesn't matter what you call it, but. For me, it's always just going to be Linux. So that is a really short video for today. Thanks everybody for watching. You can follow me on Twitter at LinuxCast. Not at the GNU slash LinuxCast, but just at the LinuxCast. You can support me on Patreon at patreon.com slash LinuxCast. You can let me know in the comments below if you like the new specs. They're actually not new. I've had these things for ages, but everything was getting blurry, so I decided to pull them out so that I can actually see things. Anyways, before I go, I'd like to take a moment and thank my current patrons. 
Devon Chris, East Coast Web, Gen 2 is Fun Chew, Patrick Gold, Primus, Marcus, Megalin, Jack Snap Tool, Steve A, Sid A, Mitchell, Art Center, Amateas, Merrick Camp, Joshua Lee, Day Dog, BSP is Brock, and Peter A. I wonder if it was the glasses that made me actually be able to say that all in one breath. It actually went really well that time. Anyways, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.